Hello, my name is Phil Hopwood and I'm Deloitte's Global Mining Leader. I'm delighted to introduce our 2014 issue of Tracking the Trends. Now in its six year publication, this year's report looks at the top 10 issues affecting mining companies around the world. In addition to highlighting key industry indicators, our global mining professionals share a range of solutions your company can adopt to manage the impacts of shifting industry dynamics and help drive long-term value for your organization. While mining companies are no strangers to volatility, 2013 stands out as a year of significant change. Slow demand out of China and ongoing economic weakness in other parts of the world pushed down commodity prices and threatened to tip certain commodities into oversupply. Despite this softness, both operational and capital costs continue to rise and many governments demanded increased contributions from the natural resources sectors in their countries. Companies floundered as a result, as many were already struggling with the cost and risk of mining deeper deposits in more remote regions. Record levels of impairments were posted amid shrinking share prices, revenues and profits. In response to this reversal of fortune, the same shareholders who demanded rapid growth in past years now call for new management. For their part, equity and debt markets shut off the taps, putting mining companies, especially juniors, on a funding tightrope. To stay afloat, many companies were forced to put marginal projects into care and maintenance and halt capital expansion. To aggravate the situation, cost containment efforts don't absolve companies from making the investments necessary to improve their safety records, strengthen community relations in the regions where they operate, or attract the talent they need for future growth. To balance these potentially competing agendas, mining companies need to make more significant structural changes than ever before. Beyond engaging in sustainable cost reduction, right-sizing capital projects, and adopting new approaches for dealing with local communities, governments, and regulatory bodies. They must embrace new forms of innovation. In a very real sense, it's time for mining companies to change the way they do business. Although there's little doubt that the market will rebound, especially as long-term demand fundamentals remain strong, the companies that succeed in the future will be those that lay the groundwork for a new operational reality today. We have two key recommendations for mining companies. Firstly, as in previous years, current commodity price weakness is likely to be short term. However, rather than waiting out the market swing, miners should take the opportunity to evolve by adopting the processes, technologies and mindsets necessary to strengthen their long term operations. And secondly, while mining companies cannot change global economic trends, they can change the way they do business. To mitigate the risks of industry volatility, it is time to pursue more innovative approaches to enhance both internal financial safety and talent management programs and external relationships with communities, governments, shareholders and regulators. To find out more, visit our website.